Hi, this is Lynn Pridmore of Spirit Healing and Wellness using the mind, body, and spirit as medicine. And I love using nature as a way of healing, as a way of transforming our ways of being that are not serving us. And today in the Northeast, we have a beautiful storm. And it started off with thunder, right? So I, I represent thunder as um, what is awakening within me? What's that rumbling within me? It's a time to really go deep within, self-inquiry and reflective. What's been rumbling around in your life, in your mind, in your relationships? And then with the awareness, with the self-inquiry and the awareness, then the lightning bolt came. And the lightning is creation, it's fire, it's let's get started. Right, so then comes the awareness of how we can take action, and then the rain started coming down. And I view the rain as cleansing, right? Clearing, so going into the body, allowing the crown chakra to fully open, and allowing that rain to come down to cascade into your mind, into your heart, into all of the cells of your body, and Set the intention as that rain comes in to clear away, to cleanse away anything that's stuck, limiting behaviors, the need to be right, uh, patterns, addictions, anything that is not serving, right? Keeping ourselves small. All the things that hold us back from living our ideal lives are a piece of what's holding humanity back from living harmoniously within one another. When we're not living harmoniously within our own selves, we won't see the harmony on the outside. So I really invite you to use today's weather. We also have a full moon in Leo and Aquarius. The sun is in Leo, all about self-expression. How are we showing ourselves to the world, which is that beautiful time. I see it as such a gift today from the weather to go within and analyze how we're being, the self-expression. And the moon is an Aquarius, which is all about humanity. How can I be a better person for humanity? What can I do? What can I transform in my behaviors, in my actions, in my words, my ways of being, so that I can serve more, I can be better in our world and have that radiate out. So I really invite you to use the weather to go within, and the moon, right? Even if it's not raining where you are, use this time period. What is my self-expression and how can I transform that for a better me and a better world? My son gave me this picture a while ago. It's of a bee and it's to remind me that I can be anything that I choose to be and know that to be true for each and every one of us. It's never too late. We're never too entrained and entrenched in our ways of being to transform into what we truly want. So find that clarity, go after what you want, and then send that out to the world as well as within yourself. And if you need help with that, if you need clarity, direction, you want a session, an energy session, coaching session, give me a call. Go to Spirit Healing and Wellness. You can email me, lynn at spirithealingandwellness.com, and I'm happy to help. Best wishes for a magnificent day and a fabulous full moon period. Thank you for joining me.